Are you serious? Are you serious? Duck! I mean, serious. There's an asteroid for the second day in a row. We've got an asteroid, this one about the size of a bus. It's going to be 33 feet wide. Is going to whiz by the Earth. And I mean, this one is a haircut. Now, yesterday's asteroid went by 200 and, uh, 200 and, I'm trying to remember, 237,000, 200. Something like that, 220-some thousand miles from the Earth, okay? Uh, plenty of room. It was between us and the moon, but still, a lot closer to the moon than us. But not today. Today, we have another asteroid, this one called 2014 EC. This thing is going to go by the Earth tonight at only 34,550 miles from our surface. Are you serious? I mean, this is close. And this asteroid is the size of a bus. Now, for the second day in a row, Yahoo News is reporting this. Uh, but now this is the second day in a row that a space rock, an asteroid, is going to zip close to the Earth uh, within the orbit of the moon. But, of course, this one is much closer. So close, you can watch the encounter uh, tonight live online. This 33-foot-wide near-Earth asteroid called 2014 EC will come within 34,550 miles of the Earth's surface this evening, March the 6th, 2014. It is very close. The online virtual telescope project will attempt a webcast today to see if they can catch it on the flyby. You can watch the live webcast of the asteroid 2014 EC uh, they'll start they're going to start their pro broadcasting this afternoon and they're going to see if they can catch it now the last time they tried to do this they couldn't catch it at all but they got a lot of people watching and listening to them talk about what's going on in space uh, you know uh, it's it's very 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 you know we've been hearing this we've been hearing this there's been a lot of chatter there's been a lot of discussion out there by some of those uh, amateur astronomers as well as NASA, as well as uh, others that have been watching, who have been keeping a close eye on this, on different asteroids. And we've been told there's going to be a lot more of it as we get further down the, the next few uh, months. Uh, there's going to be an extreme amount of asteroids, meteorites, and what have you. And folks, again... Uh, you know, I don't know what other rocks are traveling with this asteroid, but I know one thing's for sure. Comet Linear is going to come within a million miles of the Earth. You say, so why are you worried about that? This is 34,000 miles, a million miles, but it's a comet. It's huge, and it has a gigantic debris field that's 2.1 million miles wide. And so uh, we're going to continue. We'll let you know more about that. That won't be till May 24th, and uh, we'll tell you more about that. But anyway... Just keep looking up, you know, your redemption's drawing nigh. But also the Bible said men's hearts are going to fail them for fear of things coming up on the earth. And there's no question we're seeing a ton of activity. Matter of fact, uh, what's amazing to me is the, of the 14 apocalyptic signs the Lord gave me for the year 2014, number one was an increased amount of meteor and asteroid activity on the earth and space. And we're certainly seeing this. This thing was just discovered. And it's going by today. Keep, just keep, keep looking up. Get your eyes on Jesus. Keep looking up. He's coming soon. God bless. Give your life to Jesus Christ. Be born again.